earlier during the breakout group, or first of all, could you just state your name and company? Hi. <laughs> Dr. Demento. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, Packer Cove from Mileage Matrix Corporation out of Seattle, Washington. Okay, thank you. So earlier in our breakout group, you mentioned the issue of uh, technology market adoption and uh, large-scale distribution failure. So technology is not finding their way to the end user quickly or effectively is a major issue. Uh, what do you feel will be the driving force to help ease the transition of efficient and competitive technologies into the market? Number one, it's information. The trucking companies do not have access to accurate current information about fuel economy technologies pertinent to them and their fleets and in their environments. This uh, bridge must be gapped before the, this gap must be bridged before they're going to be in serious adoption by technology. The problem is evident by the fact that if you go out and look at trucks that are on the road, very small percentage of them have any significant new technology on them at any given moment. And so there's been a fundamental failure by the market to penetrate with these technologies. So the first thing is going to be that information gap that these companies find out it works on their loads, with their drivers, their routes, and uh, their trucks. Okay, great. And I know you also mentioned that one of the biggest issues that can also be mitigated by communication is some of the skepticism of fleet owners toward new technologies, and they don't believe the numbers sometimes. So is that just a communication issue, or do you also feel that there's other things that can address that issue as well? Well, fundamentally, it's a, a top-down issue. The, the communication within a company that's buying this has to have buy-in from the board of directors, the CEO, the CFO, the fleet manager, the maintenance folks, and all the way down to the drivers. And so unless all of those uh, groups are brought in, the stakeholders understand their role in that process, again, you won't have a successful communication process. What's happened so far has been a mishmash of ineffective communication strategies and ineffective uh, strategies for doing that entire process professionally. And that's something that the whole industry needs to upgrade if it's going to be successful. Okay, great.